Hey guys, so today's look is actually, I have a nice, some orange and reds and yellows going on. Um, this is my new hair look. How you doing? I hope you guys like it. Um, it's Easter Sunday. And um, yeah, so without further ado, if you want to learn how to achieve this look, continue to watch. First color I'm going to use is from an old Sephora Pantone palette. And it's just a matte, creamy beige color. And that's going to be my highlighter color. This color is called Safe Word. It's a nice taupe color and it's matte. The next color is another matte color and it's called Charm. It isn't like a, a orange color. It's an orange color, yes, but it's like, I don't know, it's a toned down nice orange color. I don't know what to say, call it whether orange, um, it's not coral. and cream going right underneath it and maybe a little bit over it over the that um, safe world the taupe brown color I'm going to use is actually a pigment from um, Inglot for my inner eye and it is cool and it is um, the number is 30 this is it right there well the pigment like looks white but when it swatched or when you put it on turns into this beautiful gold color. And that's going to go on my inner corner. Woo! And that's going to go on my inner corner.
Next, I'm going to go back into my Jeffree Star palette and I'm going to use Fetish. Another matte color. And it's like a Merlot, a deep burgundy color. And I'm going to begin with like a pointed crease brush to define it. Then I'll use a fluffy brush to blend it in. Next, it's going to be a pressed um, glitter from MBA Cosmetics. The color is in uh, Firelust. As you can see, it's an orange. And what I did is I find, I started off with my fingers. I find you get a better application when you do it with your fingers. You get more of the product on your eyelid than using a brush, even if it's a synthetic brush. I think you, you lose a lot of the product using the brush simply because the brush doesn't pick it up as well so you actually lose it in the brush and it doesn't apply it all of it But where I want the majority of the color to be, I put it on with my finger. And I pat it on. If you glide it, like smoothing it on, it's not going to spread very well. or at least not spread in a concentrated amount. This is so pretty. Um, I doubt the camera picks it up. How beautiful this color is. Next, I am going to clean out, clean up all of the fallouts. 
with my wipey. So I'm gonna go in with my eyeliner from Sigma, line Ace in black. And then lastly for my eyes, I'm going to use my YSL Baby Doll Eyeliner. It's a black in black. Once I finish with my eyeliner, I'm gonna put these eyelashes. I don't know where I purchased them from, so I'm not even gonna say. And then I'll come back and I am going to have my foundation, highlighter, contouring, all of that stuff. I will do that offline for the sake of time. Hey guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys like it. As far as lips go, I use NBA Cosmetics. Um, they're a shimmer matte um, liquid lipstick. The color is in Honey Bun. And I like it. It's a rather, it's like, it's a shimmer kind of metallic lipstick like a copperish penny and as far as highlighting goes I used from Jeffree Star Siberian Gold and for blush I used an old palette that I have when the Divergent movie came out, Sephora came out with a set, and this is it. It's called Obscure Coral, so it's just nothing grandiose as far as the blush goes. So yeah, I am soon going to be changing my hair color. Oh yes, yes, yes. And this is it. I went out. I feel like my face got a little oily. I don't know. But yeah. So as always guys, please rate, subscribe, and um, I hope to see you soon. Ciao. Oh yeah. And don't forget to unleash that makeup whore inside of you.